everyone and welcome back to Zoo Crafting! I am Zookeeper Siri and we are here for another wonderful side quest! Da 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 da! It is already that time again, the second time of the month when we need to gather up our puppies and give them a good bath. And you know, today I was thinking we would do like we did last time and take them over to the sprinkler, but we put the sprinkler over in our new soybean fields! Where- ooh, actually, um, do I have enough space? I kind of feel like going and collecting up that soybean pile piles of soybeans which I can turn into soy milk which I desperately need and let's see I did a little bit of work over here too so I was thinking oh I'll just go get the sprinkler and then I was like eh, the sprinkler is kind of far I mean it's all the way out here it's kind of a rush to get here so I was like oh well Ben made me one so why don't we just make a diamond sprinkler and then we can put it in our garden and keep it there all the time look at this Look at this, you guys! A block of diamond! A block of diamond is needed! And four extra diamonds to make a sprinkler. And that's just, oh my goodness, I hadn't realized what a huge expensive present he had given us. Because that is not cheap. That is not cheap at all. And our soybeans are done! Yes! Yes! Come to me, little soybeans! Oh my goodness, this is perfect. We have had a busy day. I'm still totally exhausted from that forest fire that we had earlier. I'm so glad we managed to get it because that could have caused a lot of problems uh, on the server where the forest fire would have just kept raging and we wouldn't have known about it and there would have been so much drama and lag and we would have been like, what's going on? And no one would have known. And don't worry, we rescued the day. We saved the day with, with our little with our little sunflower, Lily, trapped inside of her net. And now I'm covered in all sorts of things that we've collected while we were out there. And I also, by the way, found and slayed a poor innocent squid, which was very sad, but it was so we could get an ink sac to make a new squicken egg. Because I have misplaced the squicken egg that Mara gave us. So I'm pretty excited about that because it means squickens, which means something to lay ink sacs, which means infinite infinite ink, ink sacks. I think I said egg sacks. I meant ink sacks. Which means infinite ink, which we need if we're going to be able to make lots of presents for our friends. And you know what, Sprinkler? I'm gonna go ahead and borrow you and return you to the field after we bathe the dogs. Because this is just such a nifty way to bathe the dogs. And I wanted to kind of just like take them and dunk them down in the river. But then I was like, no. Because every time Pine goes near any any form of water, he drowns and starts like suffocating him and Iris. They they just, they, they can't handle the water. It's, it's terrifying. All right, oh, and there's Ash. Hey, Ash boy. All right. Oh my gosh, there's always so much to do. I'm gonna put the sprinkler down here. Actually, I'm gonna, well, yeah, I'm gonna put it down there and turn it on. And let's take all these soybeans, because we just brought with us a gigantic pile of soybeans. And, let's see. Hi, Primrose, I hear you back there. I'm gonna leave those in there. Then, oh my goodness, and there's no room in here either. Uh, you know what, I have no use for this cooked flesh, or this flesh, so I'm probably just gonna chuck it. We'll feed it to the- oh, hey, Zoe! We'll feed it to the wild! Oh, actually, that reminds me! You guys said to do, uh, like, trash spots throughout the zoo. Hey, Zozo, you want a bath? Come here, Zoe. To do trash spots and things like that around the zoo, well, what we should do is actually make little goat pens, and then people can throw their trash to the goats, and that's brilliant! I think that's what we're going to be working on in the future as well. All right, and now that we've made some room, I put the soybeans away. I'm gonna have to tend to those in a little bit. Um, and let's see. Dogs are jumping around. And it's thought that this right here is how the dogs are escaping. So we're gonna thwart their escape. I'm gonna pick this up. Let's see, I think I need to do like sapling. And then what if I do this? Sapling, ha! So now I don't think the dogs will be able to get up on that um, if I make the saplings, like the tea, tea saplings, too tall. And actually, I think I can combine these tea saplings with some, like with a poppy to make a Camilla sapling and a Cassis fruit to make a Cassis fruit sapling. Well, I definitely have poppies laying everywhere after dealing, oh, Primrose, after dealing with my, my rose red royster. Did I finish these? Yeah. Ooh, and actually we've got more to throw in here. So I think I'm gonna put all the aquatic things we gathered in here for now. Just to try to make everything nice and tidy-dighty, perhaps. 
because we're going to be working on the Lily's lily pad bridge pretty soon. Oh my gosh. See, I feel like I need a bath. I need a bath to clean up my inventory before we even get to my dog's inventories. Oh gracious, there's just so much. All right, and we're putting all the plants away. I love the plant sorting system that will sort all of our plants for us all on its own. It's such a relaxing system to have because I know everything's going to be taken care of. It's going to go more or less in the right categories. All right, so we need the flower chest. And I need one poppy from the flower chest. Thank you. And a cassis. So that would be... That wouldn't have been processed. It would have... Yeah, there we go. You see? Ta-da! And then we can come over here. And we can combine... Ooh, actually, we have poppies right here as well. We can combine two of them to make the Camilla sapling. And one of them... Ooh. Were you lying to me, little thing? Oh, Cassis fruit, not Camilla fruits, which are used to make oil cakes. Interesting. Okay, so that's the wrong one. Cassis, Cassis. I guess I don't have Cassis fruit, so I guess this would just be like a normal, a normal tea bush. Um, I'm, I'm, I'll just make it into a Camilla one as well. There we go. All right, we've got some of the enriched soil, which I can use to grow this. Phew. How's this? We're not even bathing the dogs yet. We're not even bathing the dogs yet. I've got to fix that. All right. And then you. <gasps> ooh, ooh, oh my goodness, look at that. It grew. Oh, this looks pretty. I have no idea what it's going to grow into, but there we go. There you go, come on. All right, all right. Um. Okay, and it's already ready to harvest, I think? Maybe? Oh my goodness, it did something. Okay, I'm not sure what. I'm just going to leave it be. Um, I think I'm going to break this part off, though. And that's the opposite of what I wanted to do, because I'm like, and then I can come over here and, like, pile it on top and try to, I'm trying to, like, make it so my dogs can't climb up here and get out, because I'm pretty sure you guys are 100% right, and that's the direction they were taking. So, let's try this again. I kind of fudged that. Alright, there's the tree, or a little tea sapling bush. And here's the little tea bush. And there's that. And now I need another tea bush to pile up on top. And there's that. Okay. Good. I can put those tea saplings away. And then can I put you up here? Yay! Okay, that should hopefully keep the dogs contained. There we go. There we go. And I guess I'm just going to have to throw everything in my inventory <laughs> into, into a big pile again. Because this isn't about me cleaning my inventory, even though I've been trying. Come on, open door. Open. There we go. All right, jeez Louise. All right, torches, string. Um, oh, this is so embarrassing. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna. I'm. I'm just gonna do it. We're just gonna clear everything out of the way so that I can tend to my dogs, and then we'll tend to everything else later. Cause today is doggy bath day. Water buckets seem appropriate. All right, let's put this over here and this over here. And I just need a plank of wood. And I guess I could actually use one of the safari nets. And let's close this and let's see. Oh my goodness, so embarrassing. So much mess, so much mess everywhere. And a carpenter's bed to snooze in really quickly. And actually I'm kind of hungry, dang it. Okay, ooh, 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 our grape salad, yes. I wanna eat some grape salad. Uh, look at our yard. We have a very pretty home. Hey, Zoe. Okay, you ready? All right, come here, Zozo. And there's Zozo. a good puppy. Good puppy, Zozo. What does Zoe have? Zoe actually picked up all that flesh and everything we tried to get rid of. So Zoe is being very conservative. There you go. So Zoe had pea fowl eggs and nutmeg. She picked up the flesh we tried to throw away because she's trying to be a good dog. And she had a little apple and she ran for it. Well, that's okay because she's clean. All right, Zoe, there you go. There's one puppy. Ooh, everybody's gathered to see the sunset over here. Hey, guys. Iris, you're starving. Silly girl, come here. All right, there we go. Oh, and her tail was going up. Did you see that? Oh, good, good, good. All right, come here, Iris. Oh, Iris and Alia. Alia's ready for a bath, too. She's even wagging her little tail. Iris, I haven't really taken you anywhere this time around, and you can see from you can see that because you barely have anything in your inventory. 
Alia, same thing. Haven't really taken you anywhere. I'll leave you guys both the fish. Sorry, guys. See, this also helps me determine which dogs I haven't, like, been able to give a lot of attention to and which ones I need to bring with me in future adventures. So, Iris... Okay, come here, Lily. They've been pushing the chairs around. I just realized that. All right, Lily girl, come here. Lily has gone on lots of adventures. She has crab legs. How does she have crab legs? And rattlesnake eggs. The amount of eggs that we come home with every time baffles my mind. It's like, where do these even come from? Where do these even come from? So we have a good girl, Lily. There, you're all clean. Where did I even get all these eggs from? Oh, so I might, we might as well just snooze real quick. I'm not gonna snooze in the sprinkler though. Okay, take a quick nap right here. Oh my goodness, how did we even get rattlesnake eggs? I don't even know. I don't even know, but we have them now. Zoe, are you playing in the water? Zoe's really cute. I think we should bring Zoe with us on one of our next expeditions. Because I don't mean to make one dog like sit out while I bring the others. Just the ones that are really good at fighting, like Lily, I just tend to go for them more often because I know that they're going to be able to protect us. All right, let's get another one of the buoys who are hanging out over here. Oh, I thought there were lots of dogs over here. All right, Holly, you're up. I got her. I got her. All right, let's bring her over here and give you a good scrub-a-dub-dub. -dub. You ready, Holly? All right, so as usual, our egg-loving dog has come over and she's actually gotten quite a few fish, quite a few plants and a couple arrows. So she must've taken on a skeleton for us and uh, some eggs. And actually, Holly, I've been thinking about doing a very special assignment. Yes, a very special assignment for you. Instead of leaving Holly in like the yard wandering, I wanna move Holly because she loves collecting eggs. See, there we go. She's already picked up one egg. I wanna move her in here where she can sit with Rose Red and she can sit with all of like Pochi and Omelette and Scramble and Sunny. But I wanna move Holly in here so that she can collect the eggs that they lay. There we go. What do you think, Holly? And right now she's collecting the poppies. So many poppies. What am I going to do with all these? I should save them and make dye and sell the dye to everybody else. Because why not? I want to set up a little market stall where people can like buy goods. There we go. We can have a little trade good thing set up. There we go. Hey, Scramble. Hey, Sunny. Man, I love those names. It's just so cute. All right, Holly girl, I'm going to bring you some food. But I think that she'd be super happy hanging out with the chickens because she really, really loves hanging out with the chickens. Ash, trying to hide, I see. And we can move the other chickens back into the enclosure. And I'm thinking we'll make this area a lot bigger. Like we might start incorporating, incorporating. I think that's the way to say it. Incorporating is probably the better way to say it. We might incorporate the fairy tree um, into the chicken yard. Might change up how the chicken yard is. All right, we've got Ash who is trying to escape his fate of being bathed. I see you. Uh, 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 ooh, ooh, every time, every time, he is indeed the one who is my handful dog. Come here, you. Come here. Gotcha. All right, got you. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Oh my goodness! Look at all this. A parrot egg. <gasps> Ash, you might have saved our parrot population. Oh my goodness. I don't want to get my hopes up because, like, it might not work, but Ash, good boy! I have to finish cleaning you in just a minute. He's clearly got a lot of a lot of mud and everything else on him. If I can't clean him that fast. Alright, put Poppy's away, Willow Leaves away. Oh my goodness, so many eggs. Good boy, Ash. Oh, good boy. He's even wagging his tail. He stayed here for us. Rotten flesh. And the oak wood. And he can keep one. One raw fish. There you go. Good boy, Ash. You're all done. Oh my gosh. A parrot egg. Well, you know what? We're going to go ahead and try to hatch it. And if it hatches into a parrot, huzzah! We'll be super excited and we will have saved our parrot population. And if it doesn't, then, well, that's just, that's just the way it goes. Just the way it goes. Okay. You guys ready? It's a parrot egg. There's only a 10% chance that it'll be a parrot though. And today is not that day. Nope. Nope. So at least we had the opportunity. At least we had the opportunity. Thank you, Ash. Thank you. All right, we've got a lot of peafowl eggs. Whoops. And since we already have so many peafowl, I will change it. Oh my gosh, Primrose, your little, I love it. I love how she's wearing a tree on her head now. 
Since we already have so many peafowl, I am going to change it so that she can, uh, or that Keeper Ethan will accept peafowl eggs as one of the payments, which would make some of us on, on this server very rich because Wynn lives right next to a giant peafowl like enclosure, or a jungle I should say, where she's got bazillions of peafowls to hang out with her. All right, put that away. All right, almost done. I know we haven't bathed Tate yet, and he's been out on a lot of missions with us lately, too. So I'm going to have to check that. Might as well keep the cooked flesh till I can properly dispose of it in the future. Spider's eye and string. I'm pretty sure there's spots for those guys over here. And let's see. Oh, that's actually Rose Red Dye. She's so cute. Did she just ask if she could have a coffee? That's adorable. Primrose, I will work on that. All right, a nutmeg. Whoops, that's a presser. Oh, that's right, we're pressing, we're pressing soy milk. I just remembered. All right, time to come over. We're gonna press some more soy soybeans because I need tons of soy protein isolate. As delicious as that sounds, crab legs. Can be used to make a fishing net. What is this nonsense? <gasps> and a big fish net, what, what? I wanna see that. Okay, we're gonna put the crab legs in here and have to come and do that in the future. All right, we've got some zombie jerky that we can put away. Oh, and I have potatoes. I forgot about potatoes. There we go. There, now we're all clean. Phew, scrub a dub dub. It's so fun to see what our dogs have picked up on our adventures. Dang it, no! I just realized a moment too late I put my planks away. And so I have to go get some planks if we're gonna scrub our dogs. I'm also running out of food. Oh, look at the camilla bushes bloomed. And I have a camellia fruit. Oh, oh, interesting. So what can I do with this little thing? I can make it into oil cakes that can be made. Uh, oil cake. I think that oil cake can be used to make, uh, Nightlock, get off the essence berries. I think the oil cake can be used to make incense actually that has special effects and things like that. Whoops, I gotta get those planks. I keep forgetting. Hi. She's so cute. Quack. Oh my goodness. And everyone keeps like requesting side quests where we just sort things. Probably gonna happen pretty soon. It's getting messy in here. Is that Tate? There's Tate. All right, come here, boy. Come here, good boy. I need to get you cleaned up. Scrub-a-dub-dub. -dub. What's in your tub? Oh my goodness. He's got relic scrubs and tiger eye ore. Oh my gosh, Tate. And so many fish. You are, in fact, we should start like keeping track of who has the most fish after every one of these little expeditions because this is hilarious. That poor cow is just following me everywhere. Iris, did I bathe you? Pretty sure I bathed you. Yeah, you're clean. All right, let's see. And there's Alia. Is she fishing already? Come here, Alia. You're not getting, whoops, come here, Alia. Come here, sweetie. You're not getting enough food. Come with me, I wanna make sure you get enough food. There we go. Did I bathe you? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, she's trying to fish again. That's adorable. Ash, Tate, Holly. That's three. Alia. Let's see. One. Oh, and Holly, I need to bring... Oh, okay. I know what we're gonna do. Alright. Holly, come here. I'm gonna put you right in the center. Look, she's already collecting the, the rose red dye and the eggs. That is the cutest thing. I'm gonna do a whole row of eggs so she can collect eggs to her heart's content. You can sit. So I'm gonna just have her sit and hang out with the, the puppies. And I'll bring her some special treats like dog biscuits and things like that later. All right, so I have one and Agent Noodles is finally free. Oh, and we can start putting the other chickens back into the, sorry, Agent Noodles, I'm trying to, come here, chicken. Martha Jr., come. Yay, we can start putting the other chickens back in here. Cause now the babies are named. So I don't have to worry about our lucky babies getting mixed in. Where'd Martha Jr. go? Did she just vanish? I brought her in here, didn't I? Okay, I'm going to hope she pops up out of a block in a second, because that's very alarming. Did she just, like, pop into Holly's pack? Oh, dear. Sunny, how did you get out here? Sunny, somehow you pushed Martha Jr.'s inside, and somehow I see what happened. I don't know how it happened, but I see what happened. Martha Jr. is safe. Somehow the chickens pushed each other out through the leaves. Well, that's interesting. Didn't know that could happen. They're still trying to follow me around because I'm wearing my little hat. All right, 
There we go. There's all the chickens. There. And Holly will take care of them. Good. Not worried. All right. But let's see. Tate. One, two. There's Darling. Three, four. Hmm. Where's Pine? Did I lose more dogs down the waterfall again? Oh, great. Now I'm stuck on the other side. Well, I guess we're searching for dogs down here. Oh, oh, I see somebody. Dang it, puppies. Pine, there you are. Pine, come. Oh, we rescued him. Huzzah. Okay, I don't know how we got down here, but we've just rescued Pine. And by putting those uh, tea leaf bushes where we did, hopefully we won't have any more escapees. And every time we swim down here, I remember how beautiful those cherries are. And that I have cherries, wild cherries growing down here. Just bobbing along. Don't mind me. Do, 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 do. I would love to put some of those lily pad uh, decorations that we got in here. Because that would be like in the river down there. Because that would be so pretty. I can't wait to set up that shop. I'm so excited about that. All right, we're gonna come up here. I think we're almost done. I need to count dogs again. Sunflower, I should have just ridden you back up. All right, and then I wonder how we got the gold. Oh, probably from the villagers dropping things because they're like, I love your dog, and they, they drop items. All right, there we go. Here we go, all right, pine. Pine, oh my goodness, pine, oh my goodness. There you go, pine. Oh, he should be better now. All right, what do you, Pine? Oh my gosh, a diamond! Pine, I think you win on like the most expensive thing to have in the dog's pack. Uh, you also rival the others for having the most, the most fish. He definitely is living up to his dad's standard there. Lily and Ash both bathed. Pine and Holly and Tate, so that's five. Six is Zoe. Zoe, did I bathe you? Joey, you're getting hungry. One, two. Let me think. So we have Lily and Tate. We have Pine. Where's I? I we, we bathed Iris, actually. So Iris, I know we bathed her. And then we have, let's see, Lily, Tate, Pine, Iris, Holly, <laughs> Zoe, Ash, and Alia. Okay, so we ba did bathe all the dogs. Okay, it just feel like I, I just keep expecting to reach behind myself and like have to grab another dog to clean because there's so many dogs. All right, and we'll put these away so that they can go off into the right directions. And there we go. If only my food would sort itself that easily. I'm kind of tempted to make it, to be honest. Turn off my little sprinkler. Climb into my little bed. Whew. So we took care of a lot of little tasks today and made the mess. Hello, hello cow. I made the mess of things I need to clean up in the future a little bit bigger. Also, I need to go get my stuff. And Primrose is just being so cheerful in the house. It's adorable. There we go. And let me go ahead. Primrose, you're so cute! Let me go ahead and put these away. Oh my goodness, so many eggs and a diamond. Why not? Just throwing it in here. Here you go. Have more... More scraps, relic scraps, more of my uh, graves. Oh my goodness. At least I'm gonna get these torches out. Oh my goodness, and the papaya, and I don't even know what's going on in here anymore. There, but the good news is the dogs are clean, yay! And we don't have to worry about the puppies anymore. And also let me know, I don't take a couple of the puppies out as often as I should, because a mark of all the dogs having gone on lots of fantastic adventures with us and had a good time is the fact that when we bring them home, there's lots and lots and lots of stuff in their little inventory. So I'm going to work more on taking some of the dogs that, like, like, um, Alia and Zoe out more often so that they don't feel left out, so that they can feel like they are, they too are part of the adventures. And then next time, I think we definitely need to go get more dog food. We're starting to run a little bit low. Not terribly, Tate, but just a little bit low. But all right, guys, I'm going to take back our little sprinkler to the fields um, when I go and reclaim my stuff. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.